Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you are new, take a second to look around, see what videos you might enjoy, and subscribe also. So today we're doing a quick speed cleaning video, so I've sped this one up for us today. It's just a guest room cleaning. So this is our guest room. I know it's kind of kind of funny looking. It's literally just a mattress. But hey, you know, we have the room for it and it's a work in progress. It's definitely not the top of our list since we just don't have guests over that often. But we do want to provide a space that if we ever do need, need to have a guest over that they can have a place to sleep. <laughs> so that's pretty much the function and purpose of this room. So it's not too dirty, not too messy or anything like that It because it, no, it doesn't get any use. No one sleeps in it really ever. And so I'm just doing some general cleaning in here. Starting with the shutters, because I always like to clean from top to bottom. So just starting to clean and dust the shutters. And you will see Gus Gus make his appearance in the video today. So if you're new to the channel, you might not recognize him. Gus Gus is my West Highland White Terrier. He also has some shorts on the channel, so make sure to check those out underneath Westy Wednesdays on my channel. The next thing I'm doing is I'm just using my handy dandy Swiffer tool and I am cleaning the ceiling fan. Now I'm just continuing dusting a little bit, just dusting off the headboard and just around it a little bit, trying to make it as clean as possible. And the next part I'm moving on to is just taking my wet microfiber cloth and I am cleaning the baseboards. So I like to clean the baseboards every week when I clean the house. It's really important to me, even if they're not getting super messy or super dirty throughout the week, I just really like to have them clean. I think it makes the air smell cleaner and it just makes the room in general feel cleaner. So comment down below if you can relate to that. Just cleaning your baseboards is such a satisfying feeling. Don't get me wrong, it is a pain in the butt and I don't enjoy it very much, but I love it when it's done. After the cleaning the baseboards, the next thing I wanted to do is I wanted to vacuum the room. So I try to vacuum each and every room that has carpet in it. And I guess the ones that have tile too, it's just a different vacuum every week that I clean the rooms. <music>
just wrapping up the vacuum and putting it away now. So that's pretty much the last thing I do in the room. Here is what it looks like after I've cleaned it. It looks almost the same because like I said, it pretty much stays this way all the time. I didn't have to redo the bed because no one slept in it yet. And so the sheets were still really nice and clean and the bed was made. So just a really quick, easy clean today. But make sure to join me when I'm cleaning and do your own cleaning as well. It's always great to have other people doing it with you. That way you can get some inspiration to just continue on cleaning because I know it can be hard to find the motivation to clean. So hopefully this video helped you today and I will see you in the next video.